happy to have you here for a midweek edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. This should be an intriguing contest. Our game tonight featuring the Golden State Warriors as they go up against the Orlando Magic. I'm Brian Anderson, and joining me at the table, Richard Jefferson and Grant Hill. We've also got Allie LaForce bringing us reports. Allie, it's all yours. Well, the Warriors had an unusual opportunity, retain a championship core while adding star caliber youngster. All right, Allie, thanks. Well, we're more than a few games into the year. How much do we know about this year's rookie class, Grant? Well, it's still early. We have to remember, we might be a half year into a decade plus career for some of these guys. So I think it's best to reserve judgment for now. An NBA career is a marathon. A look at Orlando's opening lineup. They've got Wagner. He's out there with Jalen Suggs. Wendell Carter is out go. there with Ben Carroll. And it's Bowl in at the four. And for the Warriors, the core of the dynasty all on the floor. Curry and Clay, the guards, with Draymond up front at the four. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Kevon Looney. Pass to Bowl. Back to Suggs. Launches it. Count it. One for Jaylen one to start Suggs. the game. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now here's Curry, a dangerous offensive player. His scoring average stands at almost 30 a game. And after winning MVP honors in 2015, Steph Curry was even better in 2016, taking home another MVP award going back to back. Here's Suggs. It's not going to go for him. So Golden State will take it the other way. They want to keep rolling here, following the win against Atlanta. And you'd have to think that luck played a part in that one. I mean, the yeah. opponent had it on the flight of the defensive end for sure. It just seems like the defense wasn't interested. They got away with one. And that 2016 MVP year for Curry Grant, one of the best regular seasons ever. Oh, so true, B.A. Think about this. The Warriors winning an NBA record 73 games. Steph shattering the three-pointers made record over 400 for the season. Also leading the league in steals. Steph in 15-16, something else, guys. Curry passes to Green. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. I like when Green looks to score. He's good at putting defenses in a corner. So much to say about Draymond's game. Tough to see anyone else in the league has a larger impact on their team. Shoot two. Free throw good. Green. And Richard, the weight that Draymond carries for this team can't be forgotten. The impact he has on the defense alone is remarkable. But then you factor in the offense ability, bringing the ball up the floor. There is no doubt he is the vocal leader and the heartbeat. And both free throws good for Green. Well, I know you spent a lot of your career in Orlando. What are your favorite memories of that time? None, B.A. You know I was hurt the entire time while I was in Orlando. No, but in all seriousness, they were great people, great city, and it was fun to see young guys like Jameer Nelson and Dwight Howard get drafted and emerge as great players and leaders for their ball club. Just four to shoot. Here's Ben Carroll. That one is off. Excellent D there from Wiggins. The Warriors have gone one for three so far. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. Pass to Thompson. Now here's Looney. He's checked by Carter. Looney against Carter. Outside Curry. For three. That one goes. Now he's one for two. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Back to Suggs. Down low. Wagner, the pass to Carter. Here's Suggs. And he gets the jumper to drop. Suggs has got five now. And the Warriors call time here for Orlando making some changes. These teams have been lighting it up so far. The NBA's top scoring teams. Number five, the Warriors. 
They've been having a great season on the offensive end of the floor. It never takes this team long to put big points up on the board. 1.14 left in the first quarter here. Kuminga, the pass to Poole. Here's Green. Banked it in off the glass. Yeah, oh, taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. Yeah, he made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. And Orlando has possession. The Warriors getting their last shot to go. Wagner rebounded by Green. The Warriors have gone three of five here in the opening quarter. The three, DiVincenzo. It's rebounded by Wagner. For Orlando, they've gone two of six to open up this game. Here's Okiki. Excellent D there from Kuminga. Golden State has gone one for three from beyond the arc. Poole finds Kuminga. Pass to DiVincenzo. Hits the trifecta. Just comes down in distribution. This is the point. He's in a to see. Here's Anthony. That one doesn't drop. Good work defensively by DiVincenzo. Not going to go that time. And so it's the Golden State Warriors closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Defense is setting the tone. Back after this.